if you're watching in video in order, this is the other video. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, anyway, so if you recall from the stimulus preference assessment, we have three preferences that you chose. Um, you chose the candle, the shoe, and the pen. Uh, now we're going to see which one of these can hold the most behavior. In other words, a reinforcer assessment. Which one of these actually serves as a reinforcer? So we're going to ask you to engage in particular responses and we'll deliver these things contingently to see which one actually reinforces your behavior. That's it. Reinforcer assessment. It's obviously way more complex than that when you actually go to try and do it. It's really easy to say, but kind of hard to do. Uh, so the, uh, w when you're running your pseudo experiment out there in the real world, just remember you're trying to figure out which reinforcer is most effective. That's really what you're trying to do. That's it. Then you can use those later on to um, strengthen and they, I guess, yeah, strengthen other behaviors. So anyway, just info for you to use in your practice. That's it.